Welcome back, everyone, to the next installment of Resident Evil Zero. We're not looking so good. Not gonna lie. And hey, look. We're about to maybe look even less good. I can't wait. You stay here. Okay. Gross. Are you... Okay. Does somebody want to tell me why I took two shots? It's a spider. Doesn't matter. Oh, give me a break. Then again, though, if it's on the wall, it might not matter so much. That door is locked. You know what? If it doesn't care, then I don't care. Follow me. Yeah. And we're through. Four grenades. On spiders. Grenades. Correctional Institute inmates list. Matthews, K. Deceased. Disposal complete. Midge, D. Deceased. Disposal complete. Keith, W. Preserved as specimen. Savage, C. Transported the research facilities. Royce, M. Facilities. Davis A. Specimen. Clark A. Facilities. Ellens J. Facilities. Terence O. Deceased. Disposal complete. Kate A. Transported to Arclay Laboratory. Arclay. Oh yeah, the Arclay Mountains is where Resident Evil 1 takes place. Uh, Jerry O. Deceased. Disposal complete. Scott S. Research Facilities. Mitchell F. Research Facilities, Carrie T, Arclay Laboratory, Roberts A, Research Facilities, Transported Individuals to be Deleted from the Records, oof. Oh, that is just excellent. And they even give me a blue herb in case that spider got me. I mean, it did get me, but not as badly as it could have. Are you kidding me? I must have been at the bottom of the caution barrel for that one. Uh, more ink ribbons. Wait, is this... Facility basement. Can this game just leave me alone? Ugh. I don't like this. Carrying capacity is looking good, but again, my ammo really isn't. How many ink ribbons are we dealing with here? And I will save, because I got through that room about as efficiently as I could have. Ugh, my ammo. I am in such dire straits. If memory serves, things are going to get very unpleasant very soon. Oh good, that was three ink ribbons. Very nice. Ugh. Give me some handgun ammo already. Also, I just noticed the manacles on the wall. That's cool. This place looks great. Old-timey dungeon door. I do remember this.
Oh, hello. The window is covered with a sturdy iron grill. There's no way to be able to get it off. Okay, but... It's a large air vent. Rebecca could probably reach it if she stood on Billy's shoulders. Give Rebecca a boost? Sure. I'm almost there. Well, I'm glad I could be of service. Time to go inside. Okay. <laughs> Why would they have this crap? Like, medieval torture devices. But no, I, I do remember this part of the game. Things are going to get a lot worse relatively soon. This must be some kind of torture device. Water has collected at the bottom of the well. This must be some kind of torture device. The spikes are encrusted with old dried blood. Oof, these chairs. An electric chair. The chair is scarred with numerous claw marks. Yeesh. Is there anything on the table? No. Just like an axe. Power supply control panel. This panel looks like it controls the electric voltage in the room. Adjust the panel. I forgot how this worked. Before I do this, actually. I think that'll trigger the next thing, so let's just do this. About the power regulator. Well, perfect. Due to the recent lightning strike, the power regulator continues to be inoperative. It wouldn't really matter about the power, except for the fact that the boiler room equipment is on the same grid. So there you go, we could unlock that, that steam vent, we could turn it off. The equipment is so run down, I'll probably have to have it fixed up all the time. If you wish to exit rapidly, set the indicator to 70. Check first, though, that everything is connected to the chain. Okay, and is this door unlocked? No. Is it locked on the other side, or...? Okay. Yeah, just the panel. I'm gonna save ourselves some time. Okay. Hooray. That's what I'm talking about. Oh. Wasting your time. I have already claimed this place for myself, which means you are trespassing, and I am very territorial. <laughs> this is a nightmare. <sighs> These are the worst. <laughs> And yes, that is how they attack in-game. Though, oh man, these things suck. I'll take the pit, thank you. It just doesn't make sense. Do you honestly believe this to be the real identity of that crazy young man? Impossible. But if somehow it is true, then Umbrella will be finished. If the old conspiracy against Dr. Marcus is revealed, Mr. Spencer's career will be over, not to mention ours, too. So, the time has come at last. What are you going to do? I will simply say goodbye to Umbrella. The biological weapon utilizing the T-Virus has almost been completed. Our only remaining task is to acquire combat data. You can't be serious. 
I refuse to abandon my work. I have finished the research on the T-Virus, but I need a little more time to complete the more powerful G-Virus. Do as you wish. I will follow my initial plan and lure the STARS members into the mansion. Their superior combat training should make them perfect test subjects. <laughs> Fine. In the meantime, something must be done about that madman. As I recall, URC is equipped with a self-destruct device in the basement. I'll find it, set it off, and annihilate the place to nothing more than a massive rubble. So there you go, that sets up the plot for Resident Evil 1. And we've also established that this game also has a self-destruct device. So this is where Rebecca is, but as you can see, there's a whole lot of gray in front of her. I have to go to unexplored territory to find her. That sucks. Also, this music's great. What is it with Rebecca being in timed peril and having great music? This music's so damn good, and I have so little ammo. And now I'm terrified of everything because monkeys are just around the mansion. Oh, in here? In the save room? That's a dick move. I really did not expect that. Been a long time since I played this game. And I'll do my best to not fight them. <laughs> that spider just doesn't know what to do. It occurs to me, I think I have to go through the dining room again. Damn. Because I, I can't really take the long way this time. Damn. Are the zombies still there? Because in Resident Evil 1, when the hunter showed up, the zombies disappeared. Oh, I'm okay with it. Oh, I knew we'd get up at some point. Damn it, now there's three zombies in there. No time for that now. There's the steam area. Oh, are you kidding me? Uh, sorry, Rebecca, give me one second. Be right with you, Rebecca, don't worry about it. Oh man, I needed that real bad. Blue herb again. Hey, let's go even farther down. Don't worry, it's fine. Everything's fine. Always is. Oh, that's a monkey. Um, oh, I'm right next to Rebecca. I just have to navigate this room very carefully. Huh? Oh, crap. Deserved it. Deserved it. You little... Oh. Oh, there's three of these guys? Hey, Rebecca, sorry about that herb. Yeah, they jump. And I saw handgun ammo. I like that. Did I enter the right room, by the way? No, I actually went the wrong way. That's kind of silly. Sorry, Rebecca. I'll be right over there. And yes, this is timed. There's no countdown timer, but I'm reasonably sure this is timed. I think I failed this once before. Oh my god. Alright, I think we're good now. to cooperate with each other. Remember? This is Rebecca, over. Rebecca, this is Enrico. Have you managed to locate Cohen yet? Over. 
Rebecca, answer me. No, sir. I have not found him yet. I'll continue to search for him. Over. Rebecca. My first mission, and I've already disobeyed orders. So much for my great law enforcement career. Oh well, I probably won't live long enough to worry about it. Billy, I just need to know. I need to know the truth. Did you kill 23 people? I'm not going to judge you. I just want to know the truth. It was around this time last year. Our unit was ordered to Africa to intervene in a civil war. Our mission was to raid a hideout of some guerrilla forces located deep inside the jungle. But the hideout was far away from our entry point. was no guerrilla hideout. What do you mean? The idiots in charge had us operating based on wrong information. But we couldn't just go back home empty-handed, oh no. Our leader ordered us to attack an innocent village. Get rid of them! Kill them all! Please, sir! Cease fire immediately! Shut up! Ugh. Do it! Did you execute those innocent people? Forget about it. Doesn't matter anymore. That was then, this is now. Besides, you said you wouldn't judge me. I'm not judging you, but it does matter. Look, now my people think you killed those MPs in the van, but I don't think you did. It was those zombie dogs, right? When they attacked the van, you were able to escape. Isn't that right? You don't get it. I've only got two choices left. Either report to the Marines and serve out my sentence, or keep on running for as long as I can. That's all. And just like that, we're back to gameplay. It's interesting that Billy wouldn't just say he's innocent, even though the cutscene showed us that he is. Maybe he's afraid he won't believe him. A wooden box. It looks like it was once filled with gunpowder. Oh, more ink ribbons. It might actually be worth saving at this point. I didn't expend any ammo. Although I am just knee-deep in horrible, howling... Baboons? Some kind of monkey that really hates me. Um... Yeah, let's do it. This is the part I don't like. Because I have to go back into Scary Room... And you might have noticed when I was running around avoiding the monkeys, there were a bunch of statues in the middle of the room. I'll check it out. Okay. I gotta deal with that. It's a it's a puzzle, and there are three monkeys. I don't even know if I want to shoot them. If I can kite them, that would be perfect. I love. I always love that. Even on the GameCube, they like jump off the wall. It was like the coolest thing. Oh yeah, handgun ammo. More on that later. 
No amount of cunning can match the speed of my supple limbs. Yeah, there, there's a thing with these statues, like, nothing can catch me, or, like, my claws can catch any horse, you know, like, that. there are all sorts of clues like that. I did just save, so I guess I'll read the clues before doing anything else. My sharp wits allow me to bring down even the greatest horned beast. I'm the king of all I survey. No creature can escape my grasp. So I guess that gets the... The horse. Also, the thing says here on the plaque, the strong pr play, prey upon the weaker, not the weak, the weaker, the law of the jungle. So I gotta do this in order of ascending or descending order. I creep up on my victims in legless silence and conquer even the mightiest of kings with my poison. So that was the king of all who surveys. You get the idea. And here's the horned beast, right? I stand tall on the earth with horns proudly displayed. And there's nothing about him escaping or anything like that. So I'll light this first. I'm not going to light this first. My god, these things are fast. I hope this works. Good. I deserve that. The wolf can take down any horned beast. Maybe I should just die, but you, you, you get the idea. Does anything happen if they kill me? Probably not. Nah, it's weak. There is still evil in this place. Pretty cool that it gives me a different message. I'll go check over there. Okay. Actually, let's regroup. Roger. I'm putting Rebecca at risk here, but maybe worth it. Rebecca's last or second last grenade. Nice. God, I do not like this one bit. Although I do like this, actually. This had better be like a thousand bullets. Th wow. What an asshole. Six shotgun shells for five pistol bullets. That's, that's just what I wanted. Ugh. Pathetic. But this room is clear anyway. Uh, you know what I'm gonna do? Let's split up. Okay. Not have Rebecca block my vision here. So I stand tall on the earth with horns proudly displayed. My sharp wits allow me to bring down even the greatest horned beast. No amount of cunning, or, you know, wits, can match the speed of my supple limbs. Did I miss an animal? Yes, I did. I am the king of all I survey. No creature can escape my grasp. Not even the fast horse, right? I creep up on my victims in legless silence and conquer even the mightiest of kings with my poison. I dance freely through the air, capturing a legless prey. Okay. My god, do I need ammo so bad. Ugh, th this is pathetic. 
Rebecca has a single grenade. Um... That's a big room. Both of these are dead ends. I'm just a little nervous because I believe one of these areas has enemies. This area is clean. There are some bottles. That'll be good for the gas cans I have in the front of the mansion, I suppose. A crude wooden desk. The drawers appear to have been ransacked. It's a fireplace. It appears to be purely decorative. Hello? Oh, do, do I... I don't... Okay. I was going to say lighting it would make it harder for me to get this. Unity. This is something I'll need. Remember, I have to go past the centipede room into the observatory and put this in there and two other tablets. I don't want to navigate those giant roaches, though. A tablet depicting a knight. The word unity is inscribed. I can't read that at the bottom. Or any of that. Oh boy. Okay. Well, we got the idea. Bottles could be nice. Oh, come on. We're so full of stuff. Whatever, I'll... I'll pick up the bottles, and if I need to drop them for something else, then I'll do that. Ugh, what a freaking nuisance. Zero shotgun shells, I love it. Um, okay. Well, there's a file in here, but... Now, here's the big question. If I enter that room right now. Is that zombie going to be just waiting for me? All signs point to yes, right? Oh. Okay. I think there might be a healing thing or possibly, but there's nothing crucial in this room. Management trainee's diary. What is it that Director Marcus is researching all the time? And what's with his weird interest in leeches? Interest? Seems more like love at times. Rumor has it that there's something dangerous about those leeches. It is true that when Dennis just touched one, he got ill with a fever. Again today, there were those horrible moans beyond that door. Let sleeping dogs. No way I'll go near them. Even if the director ordered me, I don't want to end up like Dennis. That poor bastard, scratching and scratching, makes me itch... Just watching him? Huh. Yeah, okay, that was on purpose. Must maybe go if can, but who? Dennis gone. I go hungry. Help. Mom. Itchy. Tasty. We've been there. Bye. Okay. Now that room I accidentally went into when I was going to save Rebecca. Let's go there on purpose this time. I'll go alone. Roger. A big hallway. Well, they're all poorly positioned, so that's good. Although, maybe I should leave the room with Rebecca. What 
the hell? I don't know what that is, I'll find out. For safety, let's just leave. Who knows, if I'm lucky I can reset their positions, right? But what the hell was that sound? And is that a... That's, I don't know what this is. Okay, it's just a little background thing. I thought it might have been a red herb. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna take the risk. I'll leave the bottle. Oh wow, I just can't get over there. Okay, I'm gonna be a complete idiot and risk this. It's fine. A locker key. Now can I leave? Uh, I can, actually. That was actually pretty easy. Oh, I remember this. I might not survive this. I'm actually kind of glad I didn't save. Yeah. Oh, that's important. There may be hope yet. This is going to be bad. We're coming up on a two-player puzzle. Oh my god, I'm going to hate this so much. This is not even fair. Good. Very good. Okay. Let's go. Okay. I'm gonna need to send Billy back downstairs in a second, but I want to see if there's anything for us up here. Well, there's handgun ammo. Ah. this. These guns have been taken apart. Parts and gunpowder lie scattered all over the place. Great. Cool. Are you... Come on. Old video games. Alright. Give me a freaking break, dude. Alright. Is this for real right now? Thank you. Yes, I'll take it. Oh my god, 15. What a freaking godsend. Uh, I think we're good. These guns are probably waiting to be disposed of. Definitely I'm gonna to want to hold on to that knife for a little while. Did I Oh, huh, how embarrassing. Totally forgot. Silly me. I deserve that. There we go. Oh shotgun shells. And there's something else in that little cabinet. I cannot carry this now. Oh my god. Alright, fine. Oh, wait, what's this? Is this the locker? It's locked. Just, that's it. Do I use the locker key? Yes, I do. Good. Slightly free inventory. 
Take the Duralumin case. Sure. Nothing else here. It's locked via combination lock. Looking closely, you notice the numbers 385 right in the corner. Gee, I wonder what the combination is. Ugh, alright. There, I solved it. There's something inside. Handgun parts, baby! A set of various parts consisting of a scope and a scope mount. Equipping these on a handgun will increase the gun's firing precision. So. Mmm. Custom to bust em. Oh, that's freaking cool. A custom handgun has been fitted with a scope for greater accuracy. These modifications should make it easier to hit a target's weak point. Thank you. And not only that. Shotgun ammo. You know, real quick. Oh, whoops. Oh my god. And what else is this other item? I don't know what this is. Magnum ammo. Eight cartridges. Jagged flat point. Be still my heart. One. You know it's good because there's only one. <laughs> These magnum rounds boast several times the stopping power of ordinary handgun bullets. Yeah, but I need something else. Can I... what can I do with this? I need to get a little fancy here. I'll see if there's anything else around here, but it's looking like it's a no. Okay, I remember this part of the game. It's terrifying. Terrifying, but I'll do what I have to. First of all, let me get a little room, drop this, and exchange the magnum rounds with the grenade launcher. I need Billy armed to the friggin' teeth. Trust me on this. I'll go alone. Roger. Oh god. It's been a while since I saved. So I'm I'm kind of sweating here, but this is this is this is bad. Okay. So we got this. I don't think there's anything else to do except for do this. So press a button left, center, or right. You get the idea. I want that though. You know what? Let's undo that. Left. Okay. I really don't like to do this, but give me a second. It'll all be worth it, I promise. Acid grenades. Filled with highly concentrated sulfuric acid. They're particularly useful against living things. Okay. Okay. There we go. Billy's open. I'm so not ready for this. Wait, was that? I can't go in there. Press the button. 
Uh. Oh god. Yeah. Remember these guys? Oh my god. Good lord. We good? I think we're good. Oh, okay. I know that didn't look very hard, but remember, hunters can potentially one-shot you. Oh, man. But look, I actually have bullets. Can you believe this? I have ammo? This is freaking impossible. Okay. 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 Actually, no, you know what? Come on. Roger. Why bother controlling anything? I'll just have Rebecca come to me. Forget the bottles, whatever. You can hear her footsteps. Oh, came from the different direction, huh? Okay. So how am I going to arrange this? Let's take that grenade launcher back. Switch back to Billy, who can use his souped-up handgun. Still not many bullets, but I'll take what I can get. The mystery item was a facility key, which is... Surprising no one. The water key. Okay. Alright. Now I gotta go back to the beginning of the facility. Which I'm frankly not excited about doing. I'll go alone. Roger. Because we're both at caution. At least those damn monkeys are dead. Uh okay. That wasn't so bad. Okay, that's one. Now let's do it again. I wonder if I really should just go to that one bedroom area with the zombies on the first aid spray. Just ammo be damned, I gotta heal now. Good. Good. I don't think I ever need to come down here again. And this is B3. I think we're good. Uh, Molotov and empty bottle. I did drop the Molotovs. Oof. What do I have in my inventory right now? Oh god. I'm, I might want to come back down here later. But the good news is there's like no real threat. It's just a minor inconvenience. One magnum ammo, though. I'll take what I can get. Let's regroup. Roger. Okay. Now, what was out of here? What happens when I go out of here? There's this area, which is just stairs. That's easy. Oh, actually, wait a minute. No, forget the stairs for a second. I'll save first. Yeah, let's just let's just save. Let's let's calm down for a second. I went through too much to just not save. And it'll feel good to do so anyway. Never any items though. I need to heal. And I finally found two green herbs. Had to use them both. Still haven't used them with a red herb. It's a royal pain. But we are moving. We're doing it. Okay. <sighs> That was a lot. For now, it is time to stop the installment. Well, we certainly made a lot of progress today, didn't we? 
we took a look at the basement of the facility, and this place is brutal. Just one room with three monkey enemies ruined my day. It actually took me a lot of tries to do that area with the animal statues we had the light, because I tried just avoiding the monkeys and using the lighter, but they kept ganging up on me and comboing me. There's nothing you can do once they combo you. So I had to kill them and run out of ammo. But the good news is we actually have some ammo now. Full inventory, yeah, but ammo. And we have a Unity tablet. The bad news is that in order to use the Unity tablet, we have to go back through a couple of gauntlets to go to the main facility. Until next time, everyone.